Hey guys and welcome back to some more Assassin's Creed Syndicate. This is episode number 18. Welcome back. We're still on sequence number 6 and I'm still loving London. I mean look at that. That view is absurd. That is crazy. Look at the United Kingdom flags. Our next mission is right here. And I believe it's an assassin mission as well. So yes, this, this might be difficult. I have no idea. Anyway, let's, let's play it. Let's do it. Well, what say you? You're not going to like it. Now, see here. I am graced with the Abilene family's robust constitution. Two pennies rob in the Bank of England. <coughs> the governor of the bank. I think I might need to sit down. There's no time for that. Bastard's probably deep in the vault by now. However you get in, I don't want to know. Of course. But do you know how I can get in? <laughs> don't tell me how you get in but do you know how to get in <laughs> so basically he's going to know how he got in um, yeah that's that's, that's the bank sentence. is designed to protect England's gold reserves a fortress guarded under lock and key there is the bank manager Mr Osborne only he is allowed free access to the vault you can spot him near the entrance and oh yes one man keeps a close watch on the vault door. He watches it like a hawk. If he sees you, he's sure to seal it. The guard captain, Gus Howard, knows Tupiny well. He is in on this, I'm certain. They all look exactly the same. Mr. Fry, please use discretion. The only way to implicate Tupiny is to catch him in the act. Do not jeopardize him, no big displays. This is the Bank of England. If you encounter any trouble, I'll be in the atrium. In disguise. Man, this sounds like an absolutely impossible task. It sounds absolutely insane. Entering the Bank of England and coming out alive, it just sounds like it's... Oh, man, I have no idea what's going to happen. It's going to be absolutely insane. We're going to give it a go, though. We're going to give it a good go and see what happens. Right, try to try out. Right, time to try and sneak into the Bank of England. Yeah, that's going to be tricky. It'll be so, so tricky. Oh, well. Right, let's just try and find a way in. I did see an entrance for a window in the cutscene, so I might try that. Apparently, there's a secret passage. Don't have a clue where that is. Could be anywhere. This place is massive. Right, so our first target is in here, I believe. Who's that? Is that the... Ah, oh, the Vault Watcher. Kill the Vault Watcher. Okay. I'll try and give it a good go. Right, there's someone below us. Let's go sneak mode. Let's jump in. Right, we're in. Right, so it wants me. Does it want me to kill this guy? This is the head of security, I believe. Right, let's have a quick look. Kidnap the head of security. Okay, unlocks unique kills. Okay, sweet. So if I try and get behind him and kidnap him, that should work fairly well. I mean, he's by himself, so it shouldn't be too bad. I'll try and find a way to get down without being seen. It's easier said than done. I'm gonna jump over here first. Get down, get down. Oh, is he off to now? Oh, I don't want to go that way. That was not the that was not the plan. Let's jump down here quickly. Let's try and find a decent space to hide. Is he gonna come back? Is this a good place to hide? I don't really know to be honest. I don't know his path. Like the path he takes around. Oh man, okay. I'm dreading this one. I feel like I'm just going to screw it up so much. On like another level of screwing up. I don't know. The fact that this place is massive as well. I'm going to try and get behind him. Where's he going to now? Let's get him quickly. Get him, get him. Yes, got him. Where is Tupini? Please! I have a family. He's in the vault ogling his priceless paintings. Idiot. Right. Unique kill, uh, kill. Sorry, unique kill available. Okay. So let's knock him out, I believe. 
Yeah, there we go. Then we can carry his body. Go to sleep. <laughs> right, let's go and put him somewhere nice and silent. Right, anyone nearby? We're pretty much in the clear. Let's go. Let's get in here. There we go. <clears throat> done. <laughs> first, that's the first task done. Okay. I'm not sure about any more than that. I mean, oh, what's actually, what's that guy? That guy walking off. Ooh. We read about this vault guy. Oh, you heard me. You heard me. Oh, if I can somehow take this guy. If I can kill this guy, it'd be so good. So, so good. Which way is he going to go? Don't know. Let's go around the No, not that way. Let's finish him off. Yes. Yes. Right, carry him. Let's take him away. Oh, my God. This is going stupidly well so far. Yes. I'm so pleased. So, so pleased. Right, let's put him away. So, it means the vault door probably shouldn't close now, which is good. Right, hide the body. There's now two bodies in there. <laughs> just subtly just hiding in there. Right, so it's now telling me just to go that way. And that's it. So, it's now telling me just to go there. I don't think that's going to be as easy as what I probably hope. Is that a flame pit there? Can I use that to, like, help me? I'll be with you shortly, sir. Well, that will actually work. Oh, it didn't work. <laughs> it failed really badly. Oh, damn it. That does suck. Well, how can I get in, though? The entrance is, like, so well guarded. Perhaps I'm going to try and go above. Have a little bit of a note. I'm gonna, I need to look around, because I can't just walk in that way. It's just too well guarded. I'm going to have to try a different direction. A different plan. <laughs> but so far, it's going pretty well. Fairly happy. My bank's Irish I want to find a secret passage. Is there like a passage here? Hmm. There's an entrance here. An enter through. Ooh. Oh, fancy. Fitting for two pennies, two. Does it very fancy? We've got to find some way to take those two out. Very, very tricky. I don't know what to do, guys. I have no idea what to do. Right, so what's this guy again? Uh, this is the bank manager. Kidnap the bank manager. Okay. So if I kidnap him, I can use that against him. Okay, so if I, perhaps if he comes out and I find, I find a pretty good opportunity, I can try and take it. But, so where's he actually come out to? I thank you for your time, good sir. Enjoy the day. Is it like throw Let smoke down or something? How helpful you have been when next we die. Just trying to be patient here, because... Oh, he's got, so he's got in that direction. Okay. Interesting. Ooh, okay. That could be an opportunity. That could definitely be an opportunity. If I can somehow sneak into there... There's actually an entry point there. This could work. <laughs> this could definitely work. So if we go outside... It's like another entry point. No, not that way. Don't. Jacob! Jacob! <laughs> there we go, finally. That was awkward. Right, there's another entry point just here. And go. Aha! Yes, enter, enter. We're in. Right, so if I can find. Oh, wait, oh, can I hide in here? Oh, there's a chest here, actually, as well. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> Done. So we hide in here. Once he comes back, I can try and kidnap him. Right, he's coming in, guys. It's time for action. Oh, God, I'm so nervous. Right, when's the good time to come out? Right, time to come out now. Kidnap him. Oh, please, yes. don't harm me. There we go. You. What would Let you me throw. Me do? I rather fancy a private tour of the vault. Yes, it's actually working quite well. <laughs> what? No, pick him up again. Oh, shit. That went wrong. What happened there? It said I can, the guards will let me through. Oh, shit. Get out of here. Go, 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 go. That did not go well. Oh, what the fuck, man? I must have misread it. I thought it just let me through, and that was it. Uh, that was not the plan. Shit. I think they're trying to follow me, actually. Perhaps this is my chance to get in. Right, let's go. Go down quickly. Let's go. 
Hey guys, I'm reaching, I'm going. I'm inside, I'm inside. Oh, get a pistol out, get a pistol out. Shit. Nice. Oh, shit. I'm gonna throw down some of these. Oh shit, shit, shit. Throw the bombs. See it, that's smoke them up a bit. Come on. Just finish him up, won't I? This has gone horribly wrong. I feel like it's not even my fault. Nice. He's a level 8 as well, which is not fun. Right, stun him. Finish him off. Idiot. Just keep slicing him up. <laughs> Please. Oh, I did not smoke, did he? Done. Right. Where next? Right, someone can still see me, apparently. Is he stuck? Perhaps he has to head down. How can I do that? Is it this way? Is it this way? Aha. I think this is, yeah, I think this is it. Alright, let's keep going down, I guess. Wow. That went wrong, didn't it? <laughs> it said, I swear it said I could kidnap the bank manager and the guards would have all let me through. But that didn't happen. It just didn't happen at all. So, yes. Wonderful. I'll assassinate that guy. Damn your clumsiness. Sorry, sir. I'm finding a secret passage. I don't know where that secret passage is. We will count everything later. Oh shit, it's coming. Right, can I throw just throw a dart at him? This would be funny, wouldn't it? Right, there we go. Done. <laughs> oh man, that's funny. Oh, he's yeah, gonna be insane. Oh, this guy's gonna come around. The assassin! Send him to his grave! Oh, he's gone insane as well. You've stolen your last shilling from the people of London. Those animals squander their savings. We are the experts in investment. Nothing would be built or improved. Nothing would rise above the muck without our hand guiding. No creating the future. They benefit as much as they're worth. It is their city, not yours. Without our investments, there would be no city. For the path of the dead. Is it time to escape now? Because it's gonna we have so many guys on us. It's gonna be insane. That was a little bit like um I just sort of threw the dart at him and then that seemed to sort of work. <laughs> I wanted to reach down there. Really? What does that mean? It's telling me to go down. Does that mean like down? I was on like... I don't know what that means actually. Escape the area. I guess it just says escape the area, so that's what I'm going to do. Alright, let's get out of here. I think there may be... Uh... Where can I go? There's a guy that's still... He's still standing outside. Look at him. Nice. <laughs> Killed another one. Oh, funny. Right, let's get out of here. Let's go. Uh, there should be an exit out here. Yes, we know that already. Come on, let's go, guys. Let's go. Let's do this. Yeah, that was not the most... I just threw a dart at him. It just makes life so much easier. I don't... There's just so many guys in there. Like, in one room, there's like tons. So I figured... I'll just throw a dart at you. Murder! Murder! Thank goodness the police were saved. Arrest them all for robbing the people of England. The Bank of England is closed until further notice. The currency, a laughing stock. Inflation out of control, Tupany brutally murdered. And yet Parliament does nothing. The bill will be defeated, sir. That buffooned Israeli shall be taken care of. It has been arranged, upon my honor. Your honor carries little weight. How dare you, sir! The poor people of this city have suffered enough. Today I granted a significant rise to my staff in order to counter inflation. What? I would supply all of London if I could. 
Meanwhile, you sit in your club and wax poetic with promises your honor cannot pay. Your family's fortune, however. I wonder what they would offer to keep your record out of the newspapers. About the same as Disraeli would offer for your balls, I'd wager. But let's be generous. Why limit ourselves to one or the other when we can have it all? What say you, sir? Hmm? Shall I come collect? No more dallying. The halls of Parliament must be free to govern. Again. Understood? You may see yourself out. I like how he's getting slowly more and more annoyed. He's just like losing control as his assassins out of nowhere. These two, these two twins just come out of nowhere and just almost take his power away. He is not a happy bunny in any way. So yeah, I feel like I took I took the the weak route there. I took the the easy way. I don't know if I should have just gone for it and tried to actually properly assassinate him. I don't know. Anyway, we're on to sequence number seven now. I've, I'm not sure what the last one is. I think it's sequence eight. So we're getting towards the end, slowly but surely. Right, sequence number seven. Let's begin. All is fair in politics. Dear Mr. Starrick, men hired, strike tomorrow. Disraeli's death will stall Corrupt Practices Act indefinitely. Gladstone will be far more pliable. May the father, etc., etc., be. So Starrick's got his finger in politics, has he? I need to enter the Sinopian Club and find out who B is. Tread delicately around Parliament. As if I don't usually. Your indiscretion at the Bank of England caused British currency to nearly collapse. Nearly is the operative word. Speaking of collapses, what of the key you found that unlocks very little? Henry took it for research. I am confident that the vault is ours. Nearly ours, Evie. Nearly. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Give us a big thumbs up. We now unlocked the Master Assassin outfit. Let's have a quick little look, actually, because I want to see what it looks like. Uh, outfits. Where is it? Is it this one? Ooh. That looks pretty sweet, actually. I might equip it. Nicely done. Not bad. I like it. How does it look? Oh, that is pretty sweet. I like that outfit a lot. A lot. Oh, four skill points. Uh, what? That's a lot of skill points. So, let's see what we should... Upgrade. Oh, five, actually. We've got five to spend. Jesus. Uh, I might go... For, oh, got the bottom one's available. Ooh. I'm trying to work out what to go with next. There's so many options. But I really like this one. So this is Gunslinger 2. Do you want to do that counter where, like, when someone tries to like shoot me? I press triangle. Automatically now, it would do headshots. Just straight away. <laughs> what? That'd be insane. That sounds so good. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.